Emily's great-great-granddaughter, and I work for the Emily Post Institute, where we promote etiquette in America. Harper's Bazaar actually contacted our publisher, HarperCollins, and they said, we'd love to have Lizzie come down and work with the girls of the Jersey Shore to teach them a little etiquette and do a bit of refinement. Well, I used to take etiquette school. I know a couple things already. I just haven't been using them. <laughs> I know them pretty well, uh, the lessons that they are giving, but I do appreciate how, you know, be on time, say your please and thank yous. I feel like I already know, like, you know, how to be a lady, I guess you can say. Would I be interested in doing a photo shoot with the girls from Jersey? Sure. And I was like, are you kidding me? Like, oh my God, it's like a dream come true. I'm obsessed with those girls. My role is, um, to kind of be the, the girl that's kind of gone through the school of, 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 of Emily Post and all the etiquette and that's sort of almost like the graduated debutante from the whole experience. I'd say I definitely have a lot more female fans just because I guess they look up to me or whatever. I'm a strong person, I have a strong personality. I find that a lot of like young girls really look up to me and come and talk to me. They're more my fans, I guess, young girls. Guys like the style and of the girls on my show, but at the end of the day, I feel like girls are actually more positive, which was um, ironic. Being ourselves on the Jersey Shore, we are not trying to mimic anyone, we weren't trying to imitate anyone, we were being ourselves, and um, if it's them being themselves that they don't like it, you know, to each their own, because I don't like what other people wear as well to what I wear, so, you know, we can't make everyone happy.